Now talking about the mind influencing body and body influencing mind. I can bring lot of you know examples for that, right? The interrelationship between body and mind. It's like you know when you are sad one day, you won't feel like eating. You are not interested in eating if you are very sad. Why? The sadness stops the secretion that stimulates the hunger. So it's an effect of mind on the body. Another example, if one day you are really constipated, you will be irritable on that day. You will be restless mentally on that day. It's an effect of a physical issue on the mind. And I can, you know, bring a lot of examples to demonstrate this. Anyway, there is an influence of body on the mind and mind on the body. And both levels need to be taken care properly in a balanced way.